Shalom, Israel, Mosai and Christ. Blessed today's topic is abortion, a sin. First scripture, Leviticus chapter 18 and verse 21. Leviticus chapter 18 and verse 21. And thou shalt let any, thou shalt not let any of thy seed pass through the fire to Molech. Mm -hmm. Neither shalt thou profane the name of thy God. From there, let's go to Leviticus 20 and 2. So the law is you cannot kill your children, sacrifice your children unto the devil. Read on. Leviticus chapter 20 and verse 2. Mm -hmm. Again, what thou say? Leviticus chapter 20 and verse 2. Again, thou shalt say to the children of Israel, Whosoever he be of the children of Israel, or of the strangers that sojourn in Israel, that giveth any of his seed unto Molech, he shall surely be put to death. The people of the land shall stone him with stone. What's the first word of that uh, verse? Again. So he's saying that to the Israelites again because our people are hard-headed. He said it in the just two chapters ahead, two chapters after 18. He said again, we cannot sacrifice our children unto Molech. From there, let's go to Jeremiah <clears throat> chapter 7 and verse uh, 31. Jeremiah chapter 7 and verse 31. Uh -huh. And they have built the high places to Tophet, which is in the valley of the son of Hinnomon, to burn their sons and their daughters in the fire. Do what? To burn their sons and their daughters in the fire. Read. Which I commanded them not, neither came it into my heart. We just read what the Most High said, do not do this, all right? So it's time for us uh, to start stop being so hard-headed, speaking to the females of Israel. From that, give me um <coughs> the book of Isaiah chapter 32 and verse 9. Isaiah chapter 32 and verse 9. Mm -hmm. Rise up, ye women that are at ease. Read that again. Rise up. Ye women that are at ease. Read. Hear my voice, ye careless daughters. Give ear unto my speech. The law says you cannot sacrifice your children unto the devil. So this is going into abortion. Yes, when you kill the, the, um, the seed that is in you, yes, you are sacrificing your children to the devil. All right, from there, give me Sirach chapter 26, verse 10. Sirach chapter 26 and verse 10. So we're going into the start. What? How does this even come about? All right, read that. If thy daughter be shameless, mm -hmm. keep her in straight. If her if your daughter, if you have a child that is shameless, keep her in straightly. It means do not let her go clubbing. Do not let her have a boyfriend. Read. Let she abuse herself over through through over much liberty. And what is someone who's uh, shameless? Give me Jeremiah chapter three verse three. Jeremiah chapter three and verse three. Mm -hmm. Therefore the showers have been withholding, and there have been no later rain. And thou hadst a whore's forehead. Thou refusest to be ashamed. Had a what forehead? A whore's forehead. Read. Thou refusest to be ashamed. So a whore is never ashamed. All right. So that's what it's going into. If you have a shameless daughter, it's talking about, hey, you better watch her because she's going to be a whore. All right. From there, let's go to the book of Lamentations, chapter 4 and verse 1. Lamentations chapter 4 and verse 1. Mm -hmm. How is the gold become dim? So it's talking about the Israelites. How has the gold become dim? Read on. How is the most fine gold changed? The stones of the sanctuary are poured out in the top of every street. Mm -hmm. The precious sons of Zion, comparable to fine gold. Read. How are they esteemed as earthen pitches? So how do we go from being greatness to being base? Read. The work of the hands of the potter. Even the sea monsters draw out the breasts. They give suck to the young ones. The daughter of my people is become cruel. The daughter of what? The daughter of my people is become cruel. They have become cruel because they are killing their children and sacrificing them unto devils. Read. Like the ostriches in the wilderness. So the Most High God is now comparing our daughters to a to an animal. Because what do ostriches do when they have the with the eggs? They stomp on them. All right, that's how they treat their seed. All right, from there, let's go to the book of Sirach, chapter seven and verse twenty-three. Sirach chapter 7 and verse 23. Mm -hmm. Have thou children, instruct them, and bow down their neck from their youth. So that's the problem. That's what has not been happening in our nation, Read. Have thou daughters, have a care of their body, mm -hmm. and show not thyself cheerful toward them. Read. Marry thy daughter. Read that again. Marry thy daughter. Uh -huh. And so shalt thou have performed a weighty matter. All right, because of because our nation is not marrying anymore. It's it's cool to be a baby mama, an independent woman. That's why we are getting so much abortion. Abortion is the top rate of murder amongst our people, all right? Because we don't know how to marry between, between our people anymore. From there, give me the book of Jeremiah 31 and 22. Jeremiah chapter 31 and verse 22. Mm -hmm. How long wilt thou go about, O thy backsliding daughter? Mm -hmm. For the Lord hath created a new thing in the earth, 
A woman shall compass a man. That's a new thing in the earth. The Most High God did not set it up like that. All right, but our women, they are so simple. They hate the man so much that they know that the order is God, Christ, man, woman, then child. But they they take that gift that the uh, enemy has given them and they run with it, all right? And now when they do get pregnant from the dude they're sleeping with, they go and kill that child. All right, from there, give me Sirach chapter 31 and verse 6. Sirach chapter 31 and verse 6. Uh -huh. Gold have been the ruin of many. It said what? Gold have been the ruin of many. That's that job, you independent woman. Read. And their destruction was present. Read on. It is a stumbling block unto them that sacrifice unto it. Read that again. It is a stumbling block unto them that sacrifice unto it. The love of money is the root of all evil. And when you abort that child because you choose your career over that child, you are sacrificing your child unto the devil. All right, from there, give me the book of Psalms 127 and verse 3. Psalms chapter 127 and verse 3. Mm-hmm. Lo, children are an heritage of the Lord. Children are what? Children are an heritage of the Lord. So this scripture shows you that it's of the Most High God. That's showing if you abort your child, you hate God. Read. And the fruit of the womb is his reward. From there, last scripture. Let's go to Psalm chapter 78, and uh, we're going to read down. Start at verse 1. Psalm chapter 78 and verse 1. Uh-huh. Give ear, O my people, to my law. Incline your ears to the words of my mouth. So it says, give ear to God's laws, all right? It's the law that you shall not abort your children, read. I will open my mouth in a parable. I will utter dark sayings of old, mm -hmm. which we have heard and known, and our fathers have told us. We will not hide them from their children. We will not hide them from their children, which means you could be the one to break the cycle, all right? So if you know, you know, you know people who have, uh, who have committed abortion and killed their children, you can break the cycle. How about you now teach your children the correct way? Read. Showing to the generation to come the praises of the Lord uh -huh. and his strength and his wonderful works that he hath done. Read. For he established a testimony in Jacob mm -hmm. and appointed a law in Israel, which he commanded our fathers that they should make them known to their children. It is a commandment that we shall teach our children. Read. That the generation to come might know them, uh -huh. even the children which should be born who should arise and declare them to their children. So the cycle can continue. Read on. That they might set their hope in God and not forget the works of God, but keep his commandments. All right, with that, we say shalom. I'm Elder Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ. YouTube likes to shut our channels down, as some of you have noticed, <laughs> ever so often. Subscribing to join IUIC will assure you will always stay connected to our YouTube accounts. We want to do our best to make sure this truth gets up. Please click and join our subscriber YouTube channel called Join IUIC to stay linked to all of our videos. So again, please make sure you subscribe to this and join IUIC channel to get your latest updates on all our YouTube channels. Shalom.